Hello, Dexter. Hello, Olive. Today, Grandma's going to read you a story called Do You Know Colors? Hi, Peggy. Red. This color is red. My hat is red. The cardinals are red. Do you know what else is red? Can you see red? The cardinal is red. The berries are red. This pretty flower, it's a poinsettia, is red. Yellow. Yellow is the color of these flowers. Sunflowers and daffodils and dandelions. How many yellow things can you find? Oh, let's see here. A yellow butterfly, a yellow bee, a yellow pear, yellow paint here, and a lemon. A lemon is yellow. Lots of yellow things there. Do you know what color this is? I bet you do. It's blue. The color is, this color is blue. The blue jay is blue. The water is blue too. So is this dragonfly. Should we count how many we can find? Blueberries, there's one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven things on the book here are blue. Ooh, orange. Red and yellow, when you mix them together, make orange. Some butterflies and autumn leaves are orange, like this fox. This fox is orange. Do you know what color this is? I think you do. It's green, isn't it? I mix blue and yellow with our paint and we get green. How many green things do you see? Ooh, I see this. What is this? It's a turtle. The turtle is green. This fly is green. The frog is green. Lots of green things. Oh, and this little inchworm is green. Oh, I think this is your mommy's favorite color. Do you know what it is? Purple. Red and blue make purple. Grapes and plums are purple. Have you ever seen a purple monster? Oh, I hope not. Maybe just in a book like this one for fun. There's a purple bird and a pretty purple pansy. That's a flower. Purple plums and that purple monster eating purple grapes. Do you know this color? Black. Some ants are black. Some berries are black. There's a black bird in the black bears blackberry pie. That's a lot of B words too, isn't it? There's a black bear and the black bird. Those are all words that start with B, too. Do you know this color? It's white. I am painting the brown fence white. It used to be brown, now it's going to be white. The snowman is white. Do you know these white animals? Oh, let's look at the animals. This one here is a bird, it's an owl. This is an unusual animal you probably don't know. It's an ermine. I bet you might know this animal, though. It's a duck. And this one, I bet you know this one. A rabbit or a bunny. And this color is brown. Brown is red and yellow and blue and black all mixed together. Look what we have. We have a brown rabbit, a brown mouse, and this animal is a beaver. Oh, this color is pretty. It's pink. White and red make pink. Flamingos are pink. That's this bird here. There's a pink pig in the clover patch. Pink pig. What letter does those two words start with? P. Yeah, pink pig. They both start with P. This color is gray. White and black make gray. Some of the biggest animals are gray. Some little ones are gray too. Do you know what the biggest animal here is? Which one's the biggest? 
It's the elephant, isn't it? And what's the smallest? I'll look. We have to look really hard to find the smallest. I think the smallest may be this lizard. Although this bird is pretty small too. Well, here's an unusual color. It's tan. This color is tan. White and brown make tan. How many tan things can you find? Oh, well, look at this pretty dog. He's tan. There's one, two, three, four, five. Oh, I missed the snail. Six. I think I see six animals here that are tan. Olive. Did you know your name Olive is also a color? Mix green and yellow or brown to make the color olive. The soldier's uniform is olive, and so are the olives. Olive is a, uh, I'm not sure if olive is a, a fruit or a vegetable, but it's a, a plant that you could eat, because I know Dexter likes to eat black olives, but there's also green ones too that are olive green. It's, a lot of times you probably look at this color and just call it green, because olive's just another kind of green. And here's another kind of purple. It's lavender. It's a lighter color of purple. Also very pretty. So white and purple make lavender. The bunny has lovely lavender eggs in his basket. Oh, he's getting ready for Easter, isn't he? That's the Easter bunny making pretty lavender eggs. And the flowers in her hat are called lilacs, which is another kind of lavender flower. This book has a lot of unusual colors. Do you remember the names of all the colors? What is your favorite color? Now, let's take turns. Remember to use your inside voices. Dexter, what's your favorite color? Olive, what is your favorite color? Let's see. I have to tell my favorite color, too. I like a lot of colors. I like purple a lot. And I like pink a lot, too. So let's see. Let's look at our colors. Can you tell me this one? Hopefully the video shows good color. This one's red. Do you know this color? Yellow. This color is mm -hmm. blue. This one is green. This one is orange. And here's one of my favorites, purple. This one is brown, and here is white, and pink, tan, tan is kind of like a brown, but a little bit lighter, black, gray, olive green, and lavender, which is like purple, but a little bit paler. This little mouse says here, he says, my favorite color is brown. I think the little mouse's favorite color is brown because he is brown. I know colors. This is pretty parrot. Now you do too. Thanks for listening, kids.